folic acid? Uh, great question. Uh, folic acid is a vitamin B, uh, also called folate. Uh, it's very important in the first trimester of pregnancy. Uh, it's instrumental in the formation of the neural tube uh, and in prevention of neural tube defects. Uh, the neural tube is what forms the uh, spinal cord and the brain. So therefore folic acid is instrumental in the formation uh, and development of the brain. Uh, it, so it plays, it plays a role in the formation of the entire uh, nervous system. Uh, current dietary guidelines recommend that women uh, that are planning a pregnancy uh, or are pregnant, uh, that they take at least 600 micrograms of folic acid, uh, including supplements and meals. In addition to being instrumental in the formation of the uh, uh, nervous system and the neural tube, it also plays a role in prevention of anemia. Okay, so when do you recommend women should start taking folic acid? That's an even better question. <laughs> uh, that uh, uh, we don't plan pregnancy for the most part, uh, but if we are planning a pregnancy, we want to take folic acid before uh, getting pregnant, before we find out that we are pregnant the neural tube starts forming in the very uh, first part of the first trimester. So it's important to already be taking folic acid supplements by the time we find out that we're pregnant. Um, since uh, we, like I said earlier, since we don't plan pregnancies very often, uh, it, it, if you're not, if a patient is not using contraception, uh, then she should use supplements of folic acid or at least do a multivitamin or a prenatal vitamin that has at least 400 micrograms of folic acid. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about some foods that contain folic acid. So if you don't take, or when, if you want to augment your uh, supplements with folic acid, what kind of foods contain folic acid? Very, very good because the, you know, the, the guidelines actually include the fact that we should take about an extra 200 micrograms of folic acid. So, mm -hmm. and uh, this is one of my favorite subjects because I, I love cooking. Uh, garbanzo beans, mm -hmm. uh, which I love, uh, Brussels sprouts, uh, my favorite, <laughs> broccoli, uh -huh. uh, uh, avocado, uh, spinach, mm -hmm. uh, and uh, we don't have to be that healthy, uh, and rich spaghetti, mm -hmm. uh, uh, so we can do our pasta as well, uh, beets, mm -hmm. asparagus, uh, and lentils. Yes, uh, lentil uh, soup, you, know, you said. Top, top yeah. 10 foods, yeah, yeah definitely. <clears throat> All right, so stay tuned. In the next video, we will be making two meals in the kitchen that contains the, all of these 10 ingredients. Oh, that's awesome. I look forward to that.